Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to episode 5 of the Cookie Blast podcast, the podcast where we talk about Dragon Ball and everything, but anything else fighting game related. I am your host, Subway Cookie, and in this episode, I am going to be talking about a character tier list, but not so much a tier list for um, the meta. We're going to start off with my favorite characters in the game. Okay, and this is influenced by both the anime, the game, and other things. <laughs> I said both, but that's like three things. A lot more three things, but you get the point. So today we're going to be talking about my favorite characters in Dragon Ball Fighters, and we're going to be using this tier list. As uh, Before we get right into the tier list, I'm going to go through a few announcements um, as per usual. Uh, this weekend... Um, it should be the second half of the Show Your Prowess um, fighting game tournament here in Western Australia, and we'll be covering Street Fighter V and Tekken 7 uh, mainly, but uh, there will be uh, there will be casual setups for fighters for whatever fighting game that you want to bring over. So come down, have some fun. Um, if you want to play Street Fighter and Tekken, join. I will start at 1 p.m. And at Cannington, Cannington, Canning Vale. You know what? I'm gonna <laughs> say Cannington. Cannington, um, Escape Portal. If you search up Escape Portal, you're not gonna go wrong. So Escape Portal, 1 p.m. this Sunday. I'll be there and have fun. I'll be there later on in the day. Um, maybe I might stick my hand in doing a little bit of commentary or maybe just a bit of casuals, but I'll be there. Um, I won't be playing though, cause for various reasons. <laughs> for various reasons, because I suck. <laughs> nah, but I'll, I'll I'll be there. So yeah, come on down. It'll be fun. So, anyways, back to our tier list. And before I get right into it, I just want to say this is purely my own opinion. So if you don't agree with a few things, hey, that's cool, right? Discuss your favorites, um, and why you like those certain characters um, in the comment section down below um, and I'll, I'll respond as as fast as I can uh, as best as I can I, ha I am working and I've got two kids so I'll do, I'll, do, I'll do my best but anyways first things first we are gonna get this out of the way Videl right now Videl is right here she is my favorite character in the game and she's the one I will be maining. <laughs> I am maining right now. So she's right here at the top. She, I, um, I think I said this in a previous podcast. Um, but back in the day, in the Budokai days, I played Videl. Um, and I loved her moveset. And I still do. I still do. Um, even now, like in Dragon Ball Fighters, I'm so excited. I, I, I was so excited when she came out. Um, her moveset is so good. Um, she she's all about mixing your, <laughs> mixing you up, man. Uh, it's it's just great. Like she does need a few assists to get, um, really really really, really, um, unblockable <laughs> or unseeable. But she's she's really good. Um, my second favorite second favorite would be. Um, I'm gonna put. Her Android Twenty One, Android Twenty One. So ever since um, when I started streaming early on, way like I, I think it was like last year November, um, one of my one of the guys uh, that I became friends with, um, KS Oblivion, he suggested that I use Android Twenty One. So I tried her, and now <laughs> I'm completely in love with the character. Oh my goodness. Android 21 is just so good. Like the only thing that was the downside was that she didn't have a she didn't have a sliding knockdown. But ever since with season two, now that air 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 dragon rush has a sliding knockdown, she has so many more options. Um, she has the sliding knockdown option. She can opt uh, opt not to. Uh, there, there's a few other things. Like she has a lot more options for okay, and it, it's good. It's really good. Uh, if she got, I I think she got buffed. Um, this se uh this season, which it, I I like her. Um, I'm trying to figure out whether like, so in, in our um, in our ranking, you could say that we we choose six characters for Dragon Ball Fighters. So 
the three that we use and three off that we can use. Um, I have her as one of my on my three my main team or my previous main team and is in my off is in my off team and yeah I'm thinking of ways to incorporate her into my main team uh, but we'll see I kind of like which brings me to the next character I kind of like I don't go on quite a bit so probably like if I could put their oh if I could put them exactly like like they they'd be exactly in the same spot to be honest, but I'll just put him here because yeah. I'll put him there, but really Android 21 and Ado Gohan would be in the same spot. Ado uh, Gohan's always been a favorite of mine. Um I love the fact that he like when he gets angry, he would <laughs> he would buzz ass and then when he got his so uh, his own time to shine with Cell it was it was amazing I, I i loved it and then with boo um i was kind of disappointed that he i mean he was still pretty oh, pretty strong especially with the um, um the elder kai um helping him unlock his ultimate form uh ult ultimate power but oh unlock his potential sorry unleash potential but um in super um they were slowly getting him stronger and i know you know it, I mean, I understand why they kind of did that. Like, I understand the route that Gohan took. Um, he went daddy mode, but, you know, it, it's kind of cool. It's kind of sad, but also, yeah. Next, um, <laughs> this might come as a surprise. Uh, <coughs> as a surprise, but Vegeta. I love Vegeta. I've always loved Vegeta. I loved him when he was a villain. I loved him when he died <laughs> on Namek. Uh, I loved his change, the change that he went through and he underwent in the series. And I love his moveset in this game. Um, he, albeit, he doesn't have a beam. I mean, the only beam that he's got is Final Flash, but I mean, he kind of never had a beam in the first place. Like, he was all about that da -da 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 -da, the key blast. And he's got that here. Um, he's got a DP, which is sick. <laughs> um, I love the fact that he can um, still get sliding uh, sliding knockdown um, even after Vanish, which is pretty cool. Though there's that there's that way to get that. Um, what else? Final Flash is sick. Um, his DPs are cool. His combos are cool. His key blast um, loops are are cool. I, d I don't know how to do them just yet, but I d overall I like I like Vegeta as an anchor character. I uh, if if Goku and Videl weren't so good with synergy, um, for sure Vegeta would be on my team. Um, who else? Who else? Do, 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 do. Um, I'm going to put Vegeta Blue here. Cause Vegeta Blue is one of the characters that I wanted to look into um, when I fir when Fighters first came out, and then I kind of dropped off fighting game thing for a bit because of monster hunter uh for, for for a bit but i say a bit but more like three months or so so i i stopped playing fighters for a long time uh, for three months and then on, i got back into it when android android 17 and cooler came back into the games uh, came into the game so yeah um i for quite a while but vegeta Vegeta Blue was one of the characters that I wanted to look into. Unfortunately, um, once I got back in, I felt like I needed to catch up uh, with a few things. So, um, and Vegeta Blue and um, Majin Buu at the time, I felt didn't have that much synergy. But looking into it now, um, they kind of do. <laughs> there is a little bit of synergy there. So, yeah, there's that. Uh, which brings me to my next character, actually. Uh, he's one of my favorites, but um, he's probably me leaning more towards the uh, the I won't use. Oh, no, 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 we'll put him here. We'll put him here. I like Majin Buu. Majin Buu's moveset just clicked with me when I, when I first started the game. Like, everyone was leaning towards Cell, um, Goku, um, all these other characters. And I was leaning towards Majin Buu. <laughs> Majin Buu. 
was, he was just so cool like that cartwheel was was just amazing um, I loved using the cartwheel I loved um, the solo well not solo um, the whole what's it called the the air bl the where he blows out air like you can do that in the both on the ground and in the air you do that into vanish into um oh crap i can't remember the moves the name of the moves now but um the dive bomb dive bomb dive bomb was cool and i love the fact that he could heal himself like i mean albeit not much and i mean it's a level three but it, it was cool i love i love majibu even to this day i still like him i still like him don't get me wrong i still i still really enjoy majibu but i feel like um my play style has evolved in such a way that it's not not in line with Majin Buu's game plan anymore like I I I still enjoy the character I I love him to death and I I I still support all the Majin Buu players out there I I I look for the day that Majin Buu will be in top 8 um Aliun Globo make make that happen please <laughs> Um, but yeah, now I I really enjoy Majin Buu, but I don't know. He's just not um. Uh, I don't think I'll be using him with Videl, and likewise, I think I I, I just like Boo. Boo is one of my favorite. Oh, sorry. Boo is one of my favorite villains, um, especially when he turned into Kid Boo. Kid Boo, oh my goodness! I played Kid Boo in Budokai as well, along along with Videl. So it's Videl and Kid Boo. Kid Boo is. OP. I mean, Kipu was OP back in the day. Um, and Dragon Ball Fighters, he's, well, I mean, he's still pretty good. He's still really strong. Um, I, I, I would like to play him, but he seems like a, he seems, I don't know, he just doesn't seem like my style of character. I tried playing him before, uh, before I wanted to mess around with Android 18, Adult Gohan, and Kid Buu instead of Yamcha, because, now yeah, we'll talk about Yamcha later on. Um, and in the beta, I tried out Kid Buu. Um, Kid Buu seemed really good. So, yeah. At the moment, though, uh, I kind of I want to use him. But I feel like I'm not in the right... I don't know. I want to use him, but I just feel like I, I'm not in the right mindset with him. If that makes sense. I don't... I know this. Like, you kind of have... Like, for me, it feels like I have to gel with a character with with the kind of things that i want to do videl just does it just does it for me um the kind of things that i like to do are, are everything like the long block, block strings that are actually fraudulent <laughs> but <laughs> but no one's gonna um no one knows that yet um you know just just those things it's just yeah yeah maybe later on uh, maybe if we get a season three or maybe in another game, I'll play Kid Buu. Uh, but for now, I you know I I I really enjoy watching. Uh, who's who's a good Kid Buu right now? Tweak, Tweak's a good a really. Oh, don't get me started on Tweak. Tweak, Tweak is a really good Majin Buu, uh, Kid Buu. I uh, I freaking love watching Tweak. Uh, the the stuff that Tweak um, shows off yeah, with Majin Buu uh, with Kid Buu, <laughs> Kid Buu. <laughs> Kid Buu, um, Super Noon as well. I I watch Kid uh Kid Super Noon's Kid Buu. <laughs> Sorry, my my son. I always there. Um, yeah, yeah. That's enough about Kid Buu. <laughs> uh, who else? Who else? Who else? Who else? Um, who else did I really enjoy? I really enjoyed. Okay. Freeze is probably going to be around here. Lord Frieza has always had a special place in my heart because um, when I first started watching Dragon Ball Z uh, and Morning Cartoon um, it was during the Namek Saga actually so the first villain that I was introduced to was not Vegeta and it was not Raditz but it was rather Frieza um, so I thought Vegeta was a good guy at first <laughs> which I mean he is but he wasn't at the start but anyways so yeah, Frieza was just so cool. He was just—he was just evil for no reason. Uh, you know, um, I guess one of the YouTube videos that I recently watched, um, I think it's totally not Mark. 
the way he puts it is Goku is the positive flat character and Frieza is the negative flat character like he's just he's just gonna be flat flat out evil negative um, negative character for everything and he's gonna affect affect the the world the universe the Dragon Ball universe for the worst all right that's what a negative flat character does and he's oh my goodness and when he turned into golden frieza oh my gosh <laughs> uh absolutely loved it that oh my goodness uh resurrection of f i was like oh they're bringing back frieza again and then like i was just so happy and then when then he died and then they brought him back again i was also, I was pissed off again. He's like, "Why are they bringing Freeza back? I want to watch Majin Buu fight." But then when he fought, oh my goodness! And then oh, just the climax of the tournament of power. My goodness, Frieza will always have a special place in my heart. So, but unfortunately, with the nerfs, <laughs> for no reason that he's gotten, uh, yeah, I'll probably swing him more this way. With the nerfs that he's gotten, um, especially with the Golden Frieza. Um, like you can't combo from Golden Frieza. Like you can't go into a string, combo Frieza, continue the string. Um, it's I think that sucks. That's the biggest thing. Um, that hurt Frieza. Frieza is already. Frieza has everything that you need in a character. To be fair, to be fair, like Frieza, the only like the only reason I think Frieza is low tier is because. People are not, um, what's it, are not, what's the word I'm looking for, are not, uh, ex exploring, exploring, a bit, exploring him a bit more, like there's, I know Priest and Alucard play Frieza, Tachikawa plays Frieza, Tachikawa plays a mean ass Frieza, um, I think Frieza is really good. Like, Frieza, I think would be a point. Like, I'm going into meta now, but I think he'd be he'd be a point or second, um, because his assist is od. His, his assist is freaking good. His assist is freaking good, and his um zoning. Oh my goodness! Like, if like super da like even even when super dash is a thing, like Frieza can um two three six. S or just 2H is 2H his 2H is probably one of the best 2H's in the game it's probably second to in my opinion it's probably second to Goku Black right so there's that um, speaking of Goku Black Goku Black will probably be here um in the anime I he I thought that was pretty cool Goku was like Evil, evil Goku. Um, his move set in Dragon Ball Fighters I, is pretty stylish. I, I quite like it. Um, it's basic. Um, it's like, it's very Goku. Um, so I'll, hold on, I'll probably just put. No, uh, well, yeah, I'll put it all here. Like all of the Gokus, oh, except for that, that one. All the Gokus are here. All right. There around the my favorites, but kind of in the want to use quarter, but also leaning towards touching the won't use. But I will be using Goku, um, Super Saiyan Goku, because his synergy with Videl is just OD. <laughs> but anyways, Goku Black, uh, his move set is just sick. Um, I kind of um, quite disappointed that he can't do the. Well, I mean he can do it. But it, there's no point in doing it anymore. The um, the solo um, level one uh, holy light grenade loops, uh, those are sick. I, I I reckon they shouldn't have taken that out. I, I that shouldn't have been um, what's it called? Affected. I it was pretty o like, it was pretty op. Like, but like you can only do it on certain characters. But it was cool. It was cool. Um, his his level three. Oh my goodness, like I never realized because I watched the anime. 
Like, I didn't read Dragon Ball Super manga until after I saw that. I'm like, what? Where, where did this come from? And then manga. So, yeah. Um, Goku, Super Saiyan Goku is basic. Like, I have nothing against Super Saiyan Goku also, but at the same time, like, he's not... Um, what's... I don't, I don't know. How do I put it? He doesn't excite me, but he also... He's also pretty cool. So, nothing against him. Goku Blue. Or Blueku for the... The... No, I'm not gonna insult me. <laughs> I don't like Blue. Koo. I don't like the name Blue Koo. Goku Blue. Or Super Saiyan Blue Goku. Alright, um... Yeah, anyways... I would like to explore this character a bit more, but I don't have the time. And I feel like I feel like he has a bit of synergy with Android 21, but at the same time like I'm not meaning and Android 21 like the and like I'd probably do Android 21 Adult Gohan Vegeta more than or Adult or Android 21 Videl Super Saiyan Goku. You know, so he's like one of those characters that is really cool. I really enjoy him, but I probably won't use. So, oh, actually, in that case, I probably would put him here. Like, I really, uh, he's really cool to watch. Um, the combos that he has are really sick, but I probably won't use. Um, choo -choo -choo -choo. who else? Who else do I enjoy? Oh, Trunks will probably go here. The reason why Trunks is there, cause I like I like Trunks. His moveset is sick, but I'm I don't know. I don't know if I should use him. I don't know where I would use him. I know Sonic Fox uses um, Bardock, Videl, Trunks, um, and the way that he uses Videl and Trunks, the synergy between Videl and Trunks is really cool. But I don't know. Trunks' mobility is sick. It's OD. Um, it's it's cool, but I don't know. It's I don't think it just does it for me. So maybe, maybe if I learn a little bit more about the character, um, I might. But for now, I kind of want to focus on my main team. Um, let's. You know what? Because I'm running, out of, <laughs> I'm running out of ideas. Uh, let's go. Let's start off. Krillin. Krillin is a character that I enjoy, but I won't be using. Um, yeah. I feel like, uh, with Krillin, Krillin's really cool. He's got a lot of options. Um, his solar flare is really good. But I feel like it's not, he's not as stylish enough. Like, I, I have a slight need to style on my character, <laughs> style of my, on my opponent while, um, while playing. Not like in a, not like in a um, disrespectful way, but it's like I want to feel like the move, the stuff that the combos that I'm doing are sick, right? And I feel like I, it's probably just my lack of knowledge, but Krillin's combos are pretty straightforward. I, I'm not. That's not a bad thing. I don't mean to say that as a bad thing, but I don't know he's just too straightforward for me, uh, which is stupid. And like it seems a bit stupid because I'm playing base Goku, oh, not base Goku, Super Saiyan Goku, who's who's base of the base when it comes, <laughs> like, or like, yeah, as basic, as basic as you can get, kind of thing. But you know, I don't know. Um, I don't. Krillin is just not my my thing. My my thing. Um, he another character so uh, more like here sells okay uh, I like his combos his combo routes are pretty cool but I feel like everyone knows the combo routes and I've seen them all the time like I don't know he's just he just it doesn't spark the need, the want for me to discover stuff so He's cool to watch, but I don't know. I, I I probably won't. I won't use him ever. Like you will never see me play Cell, unless the tier, unless the characters change ridiculously. 
that cell is gonna be like yeah but Android 16 is another one of those characters um, I definitely won't use him I kind of don't like his game plan and his style the style that he's being used at the moment like I mean there's no really there's really no other way to play him but you know it's like it just seems like the same stuff over and over again I'm kind of tired of Android 16 to be honest um, Yamcha um, Yamcha's getting there I uh, Yamcha's here I, at first when I first played Dragon Ball Fighters I was like yeah Yamcha is pretty cool Yamcha's sick and then everyone jumped on the Yamcha uh, boat and then now you kind of see what Yamcha is capable of and I'm just like uh, I kind of want to explore <laughs> different different avenues different uh, different characters so I mean I enjoy him I like I like I like Yamcha I like his moveset he's a pretty strong character but not for me uh, I guess same thing with Tien Tien's same same as um, Yamcha Oh, maybe a, no, a little bit more, cause I I'd ac I actually enjoy playing T N whenever whenever I random, uh, random him. So nah, uh, he's pretty cool. So there's that. Um, who else? Piccolo. Um, Piccolo, I guess, is one of those characters. Like, I love Piccolo in the series. But I guess Piccolo is one of those characters that I don't know. I want to use, but I don't like. <laughs> don't like him. Um, oh, uh, yeah. I want to use him, but I don't like him. I don't like. Yeah. <laughs> I don't. I don't know how to explain it. I don't know what I don't like. Like I just don't like when I see Piccolo. I'm just like, <sighs> like it's just gonna be cheese. Like, to be fair, like, Videl's probably cheesy as hell, but, I don't know, I, Hook, I, Hook, I, I, I love, I love your plays, man, like, Goichi, I love the way you guys play with Piccolo, but, I don't know, it's just not for me, man, but he's just one of the characters that I was, kind of want to learn to see what options are available after Hellzone, <laughs> Hellzone, Oki, um, yeah. Ooh, 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 Bardock, Bardock, I'm gonna put here, uh, no, 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 that's a bit too harsh, I'll put him here, Bardock is one of those characters that I love to hate, uh, when he first came out, he was OD, like, he was sick, um, and now everyone's, like, everyone plays Bardock, um, I don't have anything against Bardock, I don't have anything against Bardock players, but I feel like, um, this is to the extent that we'll get from Bardock. Uh, that's it. Um, yeah. He's got a really good kit. Uh, and I kind of dislike that he has a really good kit. <laughs> um, because part of me is like, why don't you just use Bardock? And at the same time, I'm like, no. No. <laughs> I'm not going to use Bardock. <laughs> Like, I'm not gonna succumb to the to the hype of Bardock. Uh, Beerus is gonna go here. Uh, Beerus is one of my favorite characters. I, even when he was still trash, like he was one of those characters that I wanted to look into, but eh. I never got into. Um, I won't use. I won't use him. I'll probably only use him in, in random or if I'm mucking around so if you see me playing Beerus it's because I'm just mucking around but yeah no I'm just gonna leave it to the other <laughs> other guy other people to play um yeah 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 <laughs> Android 18 so I'm just going down the list Android 18 I'm probably gonna put here I still want to use Android 18. Uh, there's this video that I saw from CoinJam TV, um, which talks about the snap options and her Oki options. And oh my goodness, she's just. Uh, uh, uh. 
I if if I could run Videl eighteen twenty one, I would. I honestly, I would. I'd run the waifu team if if they had a little bit more synergy, but I'm not gonna run that waifu team. Uh, oh my goodness. She's just so cool, <laughs> and she carries her brother. Um, seventeen is going to be here. Just a little bit above Piccolo. I like his moveset. I want to learn him. Axe Ice, the way he plays 17 is pretty sick. But like, I don't know. I just don't like that his normals are... Ah. Uh. Oh, sorry. A bit tired. I don't like his normals. And I don't like his... Um... Dash through the wall thing. I think it's stupid that you can't stop it until he touches the wall. Like, eh, <laughs> it's just, I, I feel like it's, it could be, it could have been so much better. Like, Bedell is what Android 17 should have been, to be honest. And, yeah. Yeah, it's just sad. Like, he, he's got... Like, Fidel can do everything that he can, but it's much easier. And, uh, like, to be fair, it's probably a little bit more fraudulent, but it's, like, it's a bit easier, and she's got a lot more, um, her buttons are a little bit better, her, her, um, like, she can mix up, she, <laughs> she can mix you up. And, like, she has a throw. Like, um, one of the things that I feel Android 17 lacks like he's got a cool record, he's got cool strings, but he he doesn't threaten you with a throw except for DR, you know. Like and um, I feel like Videl utilizes that, and like she can go into her record and then for a bar, she can go into a throw. For if she presses her media, she can do a side switch, um, a overhead side switch, mind you. So there's that. And you know it's um, yeah, this Fidel's just better in every way. Team Gohan. Um, I probably won't use. I don't dislike the character, but I definitely won't use him. Um, not my kind of character. I I say that. <laughs> I say that in the same freaking podcast that I say that I play out I don't Gohan, but I don't Gohan just. Um, it's just a little bit better. Yeah, better normals. Not stubby. Um, he gets a little bit of a buff with, um, Goku. So, like, you know, which is why I run, um, Gohan, Adult Gohan, Videl, and Super Saiyan Goku. Um, yeah, so there's that. I feel like it's more of a lack of knowledge with regards to the character. Like, if I probably played the character a little bit better, a little bit more, I'd probably delve into it. But I think, I think also the, the 2LL, the nerf to his auto combo. Oh, sorry, I'm so tired. Um, I don't know why I'm so tired today. The nerf to his auto combo is what gets me. It's just, I don't get why, <laughs> I don't get why they would nerf it. It's just so bad. <laughs> Such a bad decision. Uh. Um, okay, Nappa. Nappa. Sorry, Nappa fans. But I don't like him. I don't, I'm not going to use him. I tried. I tried. Not for me. Not for me. Same thing with Ginyu. Ginyu is actually OD character. Alright. And let me reiterate, just because I don't like, just because I won't use the character, doesn't mean the character is bad, okay? I, none of these characters, except for maybe Android 17, none of these characters are bad. King Yu is OD. Um, who was it that I watched? I watched Double L. Um, Double L is King Yu. Um, who else plays King Yu? That's pretty, pretty sick. Aqua? Aqu Aqua plays King Yu. Yeah. No, these guys, the, the guys that play Ginyu, like, kudos to them, man. Honestly, like, 
there's just so much like i feel like there's just so much that i need to remember um so much i need to know and it's just one character <laughs> just one character and you could use that one thing that one character you just body switch with me i'm stuffed man you win <laughs> honestly <laughs> but like yeah now can you is just probably one of those characters that i'm not gonna use go tanks um i don't like him but i will use <laughs> i will use him if i have to um i don't no that's a lie i like i like go tanks <laughs> I like Gotenks. It's a lie. I lied. His Oki is good. Um, his moves are good. I just don't like. Uh, I guess his, his normals are pretty alright. Um, they're a bit. Uh, I don't want to say stubby. Um, cause they're not too bad. Gotenks is all around a good character. All right, Gotenks is probably really still high. I think probably till still top three, top three characters. But I'm kind of avoiding him. Cause he seems like, for me, he seems a bit like easy mode. The reason being is because his assist can go with every one in the cast. <laughs> like you can run go tanks with literally everybody in this freaking game. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> you can run go tanks with anybody and everybody, and he'd still be good. Um, go tanks with uh, Videl is OD, <laughs> and I'm seriously contemplating. Playing Go Tanks with Videl, um, yeah, yeah. I used to play Go Tanks, Boo, and Vegeta, which is pretty OD as well. Um, Go Tanks is really cool. Um, the synergy between those three is sick as well. So there's that. Um, who else don't I enjoy? I probably won't use, but I do like watching base Vegeta. Um, I have a friend, Malice. Malice, if you're listening to this, you are freaking OD. <laughs> I, I, I honestly think you're the best um, base Vegeta in the in the world. Um, anyone can pro try and prove me wrong. I don't give a crap. Malice is the best. Anyways, <laughs> yeah, the way Malice plays base Vegeta is just, uh, it's just so good. <laughs> it's just so good. Um, base Vegeta is just so good. Um, uh, his, his, and Malice, you can probably correct me if I'm wrong on this. Um, I reckon base Vegeta is, has really good, uh, buttons, has really good, um, skills that coincide with each other. Uh, and he's just cool. And Shina is probably <laughs> one of my favorite. One of the coolest um, level threes in the game, in my opinion. Especially when he pulls it off and it's like a destructive, a destructive finish, or it kills him on the round. Like you see the, the beam going up on the world. It's like, Woo! <laughs> it's just so cool. Um, yeah, Jiren. Not for me, man. Really not for me. Uh, I like his cool move set. Just, just not for me. I didn't. Yeah, not for me. Vegito, um, here. Vegito is here. I hate Vegito. <laughs> I hate Vegito's 5L. <laughs> you have no idea how many times I've clashed with that damn thing. <laughs> and I hate it so much. Ah! <laughs> Man, I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I just that 5L. He's got the sickest combos. And Clayton and Childish Vegito and Coach Steve, don't get me wrong. I love you guys, but I hate Vegito. <laughs> I hate him. I hate him so much. Just his auto combo. I hate it. That's it. <laughs> he has no mix. I don't care. I hate his 5L. I hate Bardock's 5L, but I hate Vegito's 5L even more. <laughs> I hate it. Um... Goku, base Goku. I don't really like base Goku. Um, I don't, I don't know. He just didn't click for me. I don't like base Goku. I don't like the fact that his command mail only does one hit. I don't like the fact that I can't use my supers in the air when Goku does Kaioken pretty much in the air for the most of the freaking series. I don't like that. 
I don't like that two of my characters have to be dead before I can do seven hits with the freaking Kaioken. I don't like it. So yeah, I don't like I don't like it. Uh, I I probably will never use him. You'd have to. You'd literally have to show me like an infinite with him, and that's the only reason I'd use him. And then once that gets nerfed, I'm probably I'm not gonna use him ever. Um, hits hito hits. I don't like. I don't like hit. Oh, sorry. I don't like. The fact that his low is freaking slow. Uh, I don't like the fact that his forward punch is uh, forward light is an overhead. I'm pretty sure it's forward light. I don't like it. I don't. <laughs> I don't like him at all. Um, his counter is pretty cool. Um, don't get me wrong. Uh, there's an Australian guy, Raptor. Raptor can play the crap out of hit, but I'm not gonna touch this guy. Never. Zamasu, same thing. I don't like Zamas. I don't like him. I don't like him. He can fly. I don't care. He can Peter Pan all over me. I don't care. Um, the only coolest thing, the only cool thing I can think of with Zamasu is the fact that he can solo hit the um, Blades of Justice, and he, I mean, his his assist is all right, but I just don't like him. I don't know. I don't like it. And he talks too much, man. That's another thing. He talks too much when you feel him. Cooler. Cooler is going to be here. I want to learn more about Cooler. I want to see more Cooler. I reckon he's a cool character. No pun intended. Um, But... From what I can see so far, I kind of don't enjoy it. I I, I think he's like, I probably there's a lot more to him than meets the eye. No transformers. Um, there's a, probably a lot more to him. Uh, I kind of want to learn him at the same time, but at the same time, it's just like eh. my my time could be better invested in learning Videl and characters that synergize with her at the moment. Right later on, maybe I might be able to look into synergizing Cooler and Videl or whatever. We'll see what synergy is there. Um, but until then, nah, I'm good. And the last character that we got is non-canon Broly. I hate this guy. I hate him. His armor, freaking stupid. <laughs> Okay, now there there are ways to get around it. I just don't like him as a character. Um, his move set, um, it seems it's stupid coming from a Videl main because Videl is cheesy. Oh, not cheese! Like I, she's got some some hell od stuff. But I don't know. Broly just seems like cheese with that armor thing, man. I don't like. <laughs> I've said that so many times in the past. I don't know, ten minutes. But yeah, no, I, I just he just doesn't gel with me. I tried playing him a bit. Um, he seems like a cool character. Like his combos are sick. Um, that level three loop, sort of. Um, with the R two variation is is sick. But I don't know. He's just not for me. Not for me. So yeah, this is basically my tier list of <laughs> my favorites um, and the characters that I like and want to use and the characters that I dislike and don't won't ever won't ever touch with a five foot pole. Um, I know it's kind of rough, kind of rough around the edges, and but this is my opinion. This, these are the characters that I really enjoy. These are the characters that I really enjoy but probably won't use these are the characters that i probably want to learn a little bit more about but don't really like and then these characters i just utterly hate <laughs> napa i'm sorry i don't like you know what sorry i just changed my mind napa and zamasu zamasu you can go to hell <laughs> yeah not for me
So these are the characters that are not for me. These are the characters that are for me. That's my game. My kind of character. But yeah. Um, I hope you enjoyed this podcast. I, I know it's a bit different because you can kind of see my face. Um, you can kind of hear um, what I'm talking about. And it's also um, I, I've also kind of been staring into the other screen. I f- keep forgetting my camera's here. Not here. But my um, my OBS is here. So I kind of want to see what's, if, it's, if it's still working. Um, so there's that. Um, but yeah, if you enjoyed this video, uh, leave a like and let me know your opinions as well. Um, once again, you know, this isn't meta. This isn't, this is just my own opinion. So it's not like this is what the meta is. This is, these are the top, the best characters in the game, etc., etc. No, it's more characters that I enjoy, characters that I like, the characters that I want to use. Let me know your opinions with characters that you hate, that you don't like. <laughs> and the characters that you want to use that you find are your favorites um we might do this a little bit more because uh, I, I i quite find i find this quite entertaining i'm doing tier lists but not like meta tier list because I, I feel like i don't know enough at the moment but yeah so i'm gonna save this i'm gonna i'm gonna save it so yeah there's that anyways thank you so much for tuning in to the cookie blast podcast um thank you so much for crumbling this cookie with me be sure to subscribe and tune into the next episode that i'll be baking up which should be this week because i didn't do one last week <laughs> so this is my this is the one for last week anyways stay safe and i will see you later on in the week in the next one peace